Okay, bed mass review for the final exam. Uh, reviewing again what bed mass stands for. B for brackets. E for exponents. Dividing is for D. M for multiplying. A for adding. S for subtracting. I put these two in boxes here because um, the order that you do things in is first, if you see brackets, you do them first. Exponents, you do them next. Um, for dividing and multiplying, they're actually at the same level. So we actually could, the people who invented, or not invented, but wrote out bed mass the first time, they could have called it BEMDAS, these the dividing and multiplying, they're at the same level. So um, uh, don't always do dividing before multiplying. They're like tied. Same thing with adding, subtracting, they are tied. But dividing and multiplying come before adding, subtracting. Um, and like I mentioned in class earlier, if you ever have a tie, you have dividing and multiplying questions left. The tiebreaker is you go left to right in the question. Okay, uh, let's take a look at the first example here. 5 bracket negative 2, 3. Okay, for this, you have to realize that there is nothing in between these things. There's no adding, subtracting signs or multiplying, dividing signs. So we as it is multiplying then. If there's no signs in between, you assume it's multiplying. So it's multiplying and multiplying. So like I said, when it's a tie, you have the, sa the same thing. You go left to right. So we go this way. And it's always a good idea to underline the operation that you're going to do first. 5 times negative 2. Signs are different. It's negative. 5 times 2 is 10. Now bring down the 3. We're multiplying here. So it's negative 10 times 3. And again, the signs are different. So it's negative 10 times 3, 30. Get in the habit of drawing the line so your brain can focus on what the first step is. Okay. Next up, what if you have 5 plus 2 times 4? A lot of you, I know when you look at this, you jump, oh, 5 plus 2. No, 5 plus 2 is not what you do first. You've got an adding and a multiplying. Multiplying comes before adding. So you do the multiplying first. 2 times 4, which is 8. Then bring down the plus 5. Now that is 13. Done. Okay, um, let's step it up a couple notches. 6 plus bracket negative 3 minus 2 plus in brackets negative 5. Okay, now I know the first thing when you look at this question you start freaking out, but don't. Just follow bed mass rules. You've got pluses and minuses all over the place. So you've got adding subtractings. They are at the same level. So we're going to go left to right. We've got a tie here at plusing and minusing. They're at the same level, so you go left to right. What I would do first, though, even before I do this first thing here, is get rid of the double signs. So I would rewrite this, or you can do it right on top. I'm just going to rewrite it to make it look neater without the double signs. So 6 signs are different, negative or minus 3. Bring the minus sign down there in the 2. Then you have signs that are different here, so that will become a negative sign or a minus sign, 5. Okay, so that cleared, cleaned it up quite nicely. Now we can just do left to right. 6 minus 3 is 3. Bring down the minus, bring down the minus 5. 3 minus 2, 1. Bring down the minus 5. And now it's 1 minus 5. You have 1, you lose 5, you're down 4. Done. Okay. I know it's tempting for a lot of you to do this all in your head. Just show your work. You'll decrease your number of mistakes you make by a lot. If you had a question like this, 2 plus bracket 3 minus 5. Okay. Now, here is a question in the brackets. So we do that first. Brackets first in bed mass. That's what we do first. Let's underline that operation. 3 minus 5. You have 3, you're down 5, you're down 2. Keep the brackets, I guess. 2 plus negative 2 is what we're left with. Now you have signs that are different. 
that means it's going to be negative. So change that double sign into a minus 2 and get the final answer of 0. Last one we'll do 3 square bracket 5 minus 6 plus 2 bracket plus 2 and multiply that by negative 3 which is also in round brackets. <clears throat> People get confused by brackets like this where they have just a number in there and brackets like this where you have a question in there. It's the brackets with a question inside that's the brackets we're kind of talking about in bed mass. So don't just look at brackets and, and, and just assume right away, oh, we do that first. No, it's the question inside the, uh, if there's a question in the brackets, you do that first. Okay, so you have square brackets and round brackets. So we do the brackets first. These brackets take precedence, you look at them first. And inside there, we have this. So we're gonna do that first. So we can rewrite the entire question, 3 square bracket 5 minus, then we do this, 6 plus 2, which is 8, bring down the plus, the 2, the bracket, the negative 3, and finish the brackets. Okay, next, what are we going to do? Inside the square brackets, you got to have subtracting and adding and a multiplying. Multiplying will go up, come next because it does in bed mass, 2 times negative 3. Signs are different, so it's going to be negative 2 times 3 is 6. Bring everything else down, the 3, the square bracket, the 5, the minus, the 8. This became 6, finish the round bracket, uh, the square bracket. Okay, now in the, in the square brackets we're left with minus minus, they're at the same level of each other, so we go left to right. This, 3, square bracket, 5 minus 8, you have 5, you're down 8, you're down 3, minus 6. And now we do this next, you're down 3, then you're down 6, means you're down 9, put the brackets around it still, we have 3. Now what do we do here? It's not 3 minus 9. It's 3 with a bracket in between. This means multiply. And there's nothing in between that means multiply. Signs are different. Imaginary positive sign and the negative sign. So they're different. So the answer we know is negative. 3 times 9, 27. Okay, so again, following bed mass, um, just common sense. But show all your steps. People make mistakes when they try to do multiple steps in their head and they get overconfident. So show all your steps, especially on the exam. All right, talk to you later. Bye.